right, a day late and a dollar short. <laughs> what are you going to do? All right, this is straight up metal detecting. I am Tripwire. What's going on, diggers and diggettes? It is still Halloween. This is week three. Uh, yesterday it rained like all day. Plus, I'm kind of behind on my display a little bit. So I sw swapped out yesterday for today. And it's not a whole lot better. It's freezing. <laughs> it's like 37 degrees. But I got to get some metal detecting in. I, I have to do it at least once a week or otherwise I'll go absolutely ballistic. Anyhow, um, we were at a park. We were up here before a couple of times. It's in Warren, Michigan, right behind the high school. And the reason why I'm doing a park is as I started thinking, I really do not have a lot to build. I got so much stuff that came in for Halloween. I don't have much to build at all. I just need to enhance everything to make it more scarier than what it is so i figured i'm going to take a break from the forest and take a break from the rust and stuff let's see if we can find some coins and jewelry and some some of the other cooler stuff but yeah so the thing is is that it's like really cold and i'm behind so this may be a short video but it doesn't matter at least we'll be out detecting right okay i'm gonna shut up and we're gonna do some metal detecting all right looks like we got our first sound our first hit of the day i'm gonna dig in and figure out exactly what it is Right, great our first hit of the day is a pull tab yay here we go <laughs> all right i'll do a little live dig here due to the fact that's like like really close on top so it's like sitting right there and so far we found nothing but pull tabs that's all i've been finding i found like five pull tabs so far yay you know i was kind of hoping for a little bit different Let's see here oh, still there still on the ground still on the ground Ugh. Uh, God, I hate this weather so much. You have no idea how much I hate it. There's like right there. Come here. Come to Tripwire. I will find you. You cannot hide from me. What? Ah, is that it? That's it right there. It's a... Okay, lovely. It's... Oh, what the hell is it? Uh, just some round metal disc of some sort. I don't know. Like, it's like some sort of like, like really thin washer. I'm assuming that's what it is. Kind of cool. Kind of interesting. Finally, looks like we got ourselves a high pitch sound. <laughs> Hopefully it's a coin, because all I've been getting is pull tabs. I kid you not, pull tabs. <laughs> all right, let's see what we got. I got it out of the hole at least. Let's see if we can find it. Where'd you go? Is that it? Is that it? This is it? This is it. Here it is, we found. Oh, great, a nut. <laughs> it's like a nut or a washer or a bolt. Yeah, it's a nut. <laughs> Total nut, that's what that is. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> I'm telling you. They just stayed home today. Me and this park are not getting along at all. <laughs> Bottle cap. <laughs> I should, oh, Lord. <laughs> oh, holy cow. Look at this. Look at what we just found. It's a coin. So this is what a coin looks like. So everything I've been finding has a hole in it and it looks like a pull tab. <laughs> so believe it or not, I'm really happy to get a coin today. <laughs> yes. <laughs> all right, uh, we got another hit. Here's a... High pitch, hopefully. We're gonna dig it and we're gonna figure out exactly what it is. And we got it out of a hole, and of course, why not? Why not just get another pull tab? You can never have too many pull tabs, right? <laughs> what the heck? It's time to play the game. All right, uh, got a sound here. Lower, lower sound, of course. Uh, it could be just about anything, as you all know. It could be a pull tab. It's probably a pull tab. I'm pretty sure it's probably a pull tab. But it also could be a gold ring or a penny. So make a guess, and we're going to dig it up and see what we got. All right, did you guys make a guess on what it could possibly be? Um, I'm pretty sure that you all had a good idea. It's probably a pull tab. Because sure enough, that's all I've been finding are pull tabs. So, yep, if you pick pull tab, you're the winner. We're going to do a semi-live dig. Uh, I got it actually out of the hole. Sitting over here in this little pile over here. I see what it is. It's kind of funny. My pinpointer wasn't. It's not picking it up for some reason. But it'll pick up everything else. You know, when I need it to pick up something, it doesn't. So we'll find out what it is exactly. Uh, let's see. Okay, it's over here. Found it. Well, I think it was a high. Yeah, it was a high pitch sound, wasn't it? Oh, I've been getting out low pitches. There it is. Bingo. Hey, second coin of the day. We got ourselves a dime. Is it a dime? Yeah, it's a dime. <laughs> cool. <laughs> so I'm happy to have that with all the pole tabs. I'm happy with the dime. Go figure. <laughs> well, looks like we got something here. I'm not exactly sure. Looks like a coin. Yeah, definitely a coin. Is it a penny? I can't tell. 
It's either a penny or a dime, one or two. I like it. <laughs> cool. Oh, it's, it's definitely a dime. Definitely a dime. And right next to the dime was a bottle cap. <laughs> Crap. All right, got a high picture. I think. Where is it? Right there. Something tells me it's a bottle cap. But it is. A, no, it's high pitch. It's definitely high. Okay, um, we found this little piece, a little adapter thingy, I think. Kind of interesting, kind of cool. But we also got another sound up over here. So we're going to check that one out next. All right, fine, too. Looks something very interesting. That uh, This is the second one. I don't know exactly what it is. It might be, it actually might be copper. Or it could be brass, I don't know. Anyhow, it's kind of cool nonetheless. We'll clean it up at the autopsy table. Cool, got another hit. High pitch. See what it is. Silver ring would be real nice. <laughs> and no such luck. Definitely not a silver ring at all. <laughs> it's like a stupid piece of aluminum, I guess. <laughs> oh well, I'll take it. All right, I'm um, just going to be the last one for today. Uh, where to go? Had a high pitch over here somewhere. There it is. Yeah, it's going to be the last one for today because I still got a whole bunch of stuff to do. So let's uh, dig this up and see what we got. This is the autopsy table. This is where I go over everything that I found within this last week. Even though it was only out for an hour today. And that was basically about it. Because I still got to get to work on the Halloween stuff. But we're going to go over everything. Um, let's see. There's the washer. There's the bolt. You guys didn't see the nail. But you did see like this little piece here. Uh, just some aluminum I guess. Got ourselves some bottle caps. So that's kind of interesting. I told you it was a pull tab day. I told you it was because I found a lot of pull tabs. <laughs> Over here uh, in the metal sludge area, uh, we just got some stuff that I picked up with the magnet. That's kind of cool. I actually have surface finds this week. Uh, found ourselves a Nerf bullet. Uh, I don't know what a stapler was doing in the middle of a park, to be honest. I have no clue. But we did find a horse. I, I don't know what his name is because a horse with no name. Okay, bad joke. They get worse. <laughs> Found ourselves a 10 cent Pepsi can or Coca Cola can. And what we're going to do is go to the DVD pick of the week. Yes, I said DVD. Um, House of a Thousand Corpses was directed by Rob Zombie. Now, I don't know if you guys seen this movie or not. Um, it's an okay movie. It's an okay. I expected more from Rob, to be honest with you. But if you never saw this, here's what you're going to want to do. Big time. Check this out. Uh, watch the movie. Then when the movie's over, go back to the beginning. And then put in commentary by Rob Zombie. It is hilarious. It was. He tells you everything that went wrong. He's making tons of jokes. I find it to be absolutely hysterical. I, I won't watch this without Rob Zombie's commentary. That's how cool it is. So, the DVD of the week is House of a Thousand Corpses. And yeah, hit the commentary. It is awesome. Okay, over to the cooler stuff. I I found some more coins on the way back from the car. Uh, yeah, just about five pennies and three dimes. Which for an hour, I don't, I don't think it's that bad. Okay, I can't remember if I showed you this or not, but I found that blade, that saw blade. I said I can do something with it, and sure enough, I just made a little small dagger, just out of bones and a knife. Copper! Yes! Got something for the retirement fund. We got the copper there, so that's totally awesome. That's actually, the pick of the week is copper. Now we're going to move over to Hellsent Halloween Station. Yes! Um, real quick, real quick. Boom! There's the eye. Thank you guys so much for leaving your comments. I highly appreciate it. Um, yeah, I'm really beginning to like the way uh, George is looking here. But to be honest, George is done. Um, I got so much other stuff I need to do. But yeah, thanks again. But I do have another question for you. Okay, I got this head here. And I can't decide. I had to use the wig for something else. Um, I can't decide on whether I should do green hair or if I should do purple hair. So it's up to you guys. Just leave a G or a P in the comments, and the most letters win. Cool. 
So please leave a comment. All right, I thank you all very much for watching. This is Straight Up Metal Detecting. I am Tripwire. We only have one more week of Hunt a Ween next week. So y'all better get ready and hey, do me a favor. Like, subscribe, and keep the hunt alive. See you next week. Hunt a Ween.